Hello. Now in this exercise, we are asked to write a program that declares three variables. We're going to name them age one, age two, and age three. And we want to assign any age that we wish to each of the three variables. And then we are going to use the print method to output the ages to the screen separated by commas. So you should have already done this yourself. There are many ways to do it, slight variations in how our programs are going to look. But here's how I did it. So we have our main method here. Notice uh, this comment is encapsulated in the block comment there with star, uh, slash uh, asterisk and then asterisk slash. So everything in here is just going to be ignored by the compiler. Here we have some comments separated by double slashes or, or started by double slashes. Um, and so these are all comments as well. So inside the main method, we have the opening bracket here. The closing uh, bracket is highlighted down below. We initialize or declare three different variables. We're naming them age one, age two, and age three. And we are calling them integers because integer variables are basically whole number variables, negative or positive. So after we declare them, we have to assign something to them. Here I'm just making up ages, 10 years old for age one, 14 years old for age two, uh, 36 year olds for age three. And so you can see I'm assigning the ages to the variables there. Now we're going to print it out. System dot out dot print line. Uh, age one is going to print the value of age uh, one. And then we have a plus. And so now we're encapsulating some character in double quotations. Everything between here will be printed. So we have a comma and a space. And then we have plus age two. And then we have a comma space printed because it's in between the quotation marks. And then we have a plus and we have age three. So everywhere you see the variable, it's going to print the value of the variable. Everything in between the quotations will show comma and a space. And that's what we're asked to do. Output the ages to the screen separated by commas. So if we run it here, we'll look in the console. And when we run it, we see 10 comma 14 comma 36, which is the value of the three different variables that I've assigned in my program. So this is how I've done it. Your method might look slightly different. You could uh, uh, declare these variables all in one line if you wish. You could say in uh, int age one comma age two comma age three and then put a semicolon there. That's one way it could look different. You might have slightly different formatting down here, but this is the gist of how you do this exercise in Java.